Hey everybody, I'm Josh. I'm Jace. We're gonna react to Fu Made It Alchemist Brotherhood. Yeah. And uh just heads up. Uh we're actually using a new piece of equipment that I wanted to uh credit real quick. This is the uh Sound Blaster G3 from Creative. It's gonna be so much louder to hear then. Oh my god, I'm I've been I've needed this thing so badly. Oh yeah. It sounds Because we hate our eardrums. Alright. Exactly. Um so Okay, last can episode. Never, I can never hear anything over his right. talking, but now this will hopefully... Fuck you. Hopefully, yeah, fuck you too. Uh, this will hopefully help that, so... So, uh, last episode we had the Lior... Uh, was it Lior? I think it was Lior. That's the, this, the religious people situation. And he baits the dude into confessing his wrongdoings. Oh, and then Lust well, and Gluttony kill him. That's an interesting optical cable. Lust and Gluttony kill him. Mm. Lust killed him, and Gluttony ate him. So, I... The thing about the brother, the, the episodes is that like when you watched Avatar, like you, we said the name of the episode, and then we, you would you would remember what happened because every episode of uh, Avatar was very much like defined by it's like episodic. Like, you remember the episode with Brotherhood. I just remember it as like one long story. Wait, you checked the sources, right? I did check the sources. Okay. With Brotherhood, it's like one long story. I don't remember what episode has what. Like we're gonna watch the episode, and I'm probably gonna be like. Oh yeah, this is that. The episode episode. will play and then it will end. It will play and then it will end. Exactly. <laughs> uh, what ha happened in the last episode? We had, uh, yeah, the philosopher stone. I told you that philosopher stones can run out of juice. Right. And that's what happened to that one. It just ran out of juice. And then I can't wait to get to this one. There's like these real. There's like some really cool fight scenes I want to get to. I, I will comment. We were just looking at an old episode. I love how much expression they get out of Alphonse, despite the fact that his face doesn't move. <laughs> Although it does move. It makes those weird, like, cartoony faces. Well, yeah, that, I'm saying the animation is, uh, that's what the animation does. <laughs> You're not supposed to get any emotion out of him. Yeah. This ain't no Mandalorian. Uh, fucking hell. So, yeah, a Mandalorian. <laughs> All right, let's just go for it. I don't even remember. I can't really talk. I don't even remember what happens in this episode. So let's go. One. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. I think you're about to meet, like, your third homunculus. Third? Yeah, which is the, the, the homunculus is... The, the plural is homunculi. But... Do you... Re so you don't remember any of that? I remember some of that episode, but I clearly didn't watch enough of it. But honestly, I thank like, God I didn't, because you got to see me just get fucking... Ugh. There's, like, so many memes. That is it's so a... fucked up. Okay, yeah. I will say this, though. In the in the original show, Full Metal Alchemist, it was handled better because the way it worked is, remember in the first episode where Maze Hughes is like, I heard you boys don't have a place to stay. So for those episodes, for, like, the beginning of the episodes, like the first part of the show, they just stay at Shout Tucker's house with Nina, and you actually see them like bond over time like throughout the episodes not all and then it happens and it gets it's more tragic because it's like a character you spent time with but with this it's just uh all in one episode and it's because you know about the whole like rushed pacing of the beginning to get to you know what i mean and it's kind of a shame like people consider full metal alchemist and full metal alchemist brotherhood to be like the two incomplete series with brotherhood being the, the more likely the better one. Oh my god i remember as soon as i realized I think I, as soon as I realized what episode this was, I turned to you, I'm like, so wait, have you seen this episode before? And you were like, oh, I think I've only seen about the first half of it. And I was, I was like kind of extremely happy that was, you, that, that was your answer. And I was like, oh, he's going to. That pisses me off. He's going to react. There. I'm like, he's going to react good. That's not okay. Man. It's not okay. That's... Like there's memes of like Nina's silhouette. Like who's that Pokemon? It's supposed to, I think it's supposed to also serve as like a, like a holding up a mirror to Ed. It's like, hey, look what you did to your brother, and look what I did to my daughter. We're kind of the same. Yeah, that guy, I'm, I'm not going to tell you his name, because I want you to, I think I'll just save it for later. That one guy with the tan skin who is, like, making people all bloody, that's a cool guy. He's a cool character. I do like the idea of, like, man, this old radio, we're, we're going to need to get a new one. <laughs> Brand spanking new. It's like, God, alchemy is so handy. Especially Ed's alchemy. Would you, Chase, would you give up a leg to do that shit. I'll, I'll spicy it up. Would you sacrifice an arm and a leg to be able to have Ed's powers? No. Really? I think I would. You don't understand, Jace. 
Ed is ridiculously powerful. But I feel like... There are other things I would rather be. People like, who are more powerful than Ed in different franchises. Yeah, okay, who fine. didn't have to give up an arm and a leg. Fine, 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 fine. I just... like I feel like in real life it's harder because... The first step of alchemy is comprehension or like or like understanding. You need to know what it is that you're performing alchemy on and like what it's made out of. Like if I did this and just like I wanted to, tr- to transmute my pants, I don't know like what it's made out of. I'm gonna guess wool, but I have that's to, not an element. I, I probably, have to know the elements. You probably have to know it on like a like a molecular level. Like you have to know how much. Like if you're gonna water, you know water. All that is. Is it's two parts? Hyd- two parts hydrogen, one part oxygen. In terms of atom, in terms of atoms, yes. Yes. But each of those has a different weight. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's just one of those things where it's easier. <laughs> it's easier, like it's one of those powers where it's easier to watch it on an anime than it is to like ha- probably do in real life. But it, al- when I watch, when I watch Fullmetal Alchemist Brotherhood, it's the same thing when we watch Avatar. It's like you see when you watch like a really good show and they're doing these powers that you're just like, that's really cool. I want to do that. You know. <laughs> That'd be cool. For the record, like the episodes I'm looking forward to is the Fifth Laboratory. It's uh, that term's not gonna spoil anything. And uh, and then the other the other episode I'm looking forward to is is a uh, the one with greed. So I really thought we were gonna meet the other homunculus that's with uh, lust and gluttony. And who the heck was that guy at the end in the beginning of that episode? Oh, he's not a homunculus. I didn't say, but who was he? He's, he's going around and he's killing state alchemists cause he, and he has his reasons but we're leaving it up in the air for now. He's seeming like the uh, hero killer. <laughs> Are you sure? I am getting those vibes. You are right. Yeah. Ugh. But um, it's funny because Ida was the one who went up against the hero killer and my hero. Now he is the hero killer. He was the hero killer. He was originally... He was yeah, the hero yeah. killer first. So what, what's crazy about that is that the guy that he or fights... alchemist killer there. The guy that he fights, the alchemist assassin. <laughs> it's like it's like it's like that one year where in the like in the Flash and that one it, it, this is all in the same year, season five was going on. It was about a guy who wanted to kill all the metahumans. At the same time, it was whatever season was in <laughs> of Arrow where it was like I want to kill all the vigilantes. And then in the same time in Supergirl, it was like the bad guy was somebody who wanted to kill all the aliens. And then there's another guy in. Uh... <laughs> In, D- in uh, Legends, of, Legends Tomorrow. of Tomorrow, he's like, I want to kill all the time travelers. This, this, I don't think it was at the time. Of course, but, that's that's that guy would have the hardest job because they just time travel all over the damn place yeah. and killing them. He's just like, and then in my he hero, the timeline. Like, my hero, I'm gonna kill all the heroes. And then in this show, I'm gonna kill all the state alchemists. The, what's crazy enough is that that, that and in this dude, reality, I'm gonna kill all the Josh, all the all <laughs> Joshes, <laughs> all the reactors. Yeah. So on, so um, the. Uh, the dude he killed in the beginning, I think he, I think his title was Brigadier General. He's the, he was the Iron Blood Alchemist. I think his shtick was that he could manipulate the ground and shit. I don't know, because you know how there's iron, actual iron in blood, right? He could, I think he could transmute Wait, the, uh, iron in blood. What yeah, you, like the actual. You know, there's blood in iron. Be like other way around, dude. Y- yes, there's iron in blood. He could transmute the iron in his blood and do stuff with it. In the original show, that dude was kind of a antagonistic foil. Not really like a dude Ed and Al fought, but more just like an asshole who wouldn't let them do certain things and shit like that. And then and then eventually he's killed by him. <laughs> eventually. But then this episode, like, just, you know, just do it. Get it out of the way. All right. Like, I'm pretty sure, like, he that dude dies in the original show. He died in, like, episode, like, 15 or 20. I don't even remember, but it was a while. I mean, this is only episode four. All right. Just a reminder, Patreon is a thing. Pay, pay, uh, pledge $1, you get the full length. Pledge $3, you get to watch next week's episode right now. So, Jace, uh, let's uh, let's get a drink. We're going to need a drink after this. <laughs> what do you mean a drink? Just because like this, this is like the most disturbing episode of all time. I hate it. Oh, you mean alcohol? Alcohol, yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, all right, I can use a drink. Just uh, Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. I'm Jace. I'm Josh. We'll see you guys in the next one.